Hello everyone. Um, I wanted to make a, a quick video. Um, a bit uh, more than a month ago, something like that, I made a video about uh, uh, selecting 12 or 24 volts on the uh, drivers. And it looks like uh, some people got confused of what I meant. Uh, I was speaking about this, my particular uh, configuration, uh, which is different from others and different from what uh, in general you can do with the, with the board. Uh, so I wanted to make sure that it was clear to everyone uh, what the board is capable uh, of uh, doing with the uh, power input of the board and the uh, separate uh, power input for the uh, motor driver. So, for the power of the board, you can set it as uh, 12 or 24 volts, while the motor power of drivers, uh, you can set it as uh, 12, 24, 48, or, six, or 56 volts. Now, uh, on top of here, and, uh, and I showed last time, there are uh, jumpers on every single drivers. Uh, this jumper will select where this driver or motor gets the power from. So you can set it in one way and it gets the power from this terminal of the board. Or you can set it in another way and you can get the drivers to get the power from the motor drivers, which is the preferred uh, way to do it because you can separate the power from the board to the power to the drivers. And also you have more choices because you can set the power of the drivers from 12, 24, 48 or 56 volts. So how you do that? So on top of here there are jumpers and there are three pins. So on the back of the board, also this is in the manual so you can read the manual about. On the back of the board uh, let's see if you focus. Okay, here. You can read VBB or HB. Okay? So, VBB is the power input of the board and HB is the power input of the drivers. So, if you go back. So, I set if you remember, uh, HV is on the right side, which means on the left side on the top. So I set the jumper on the left side, so I select HV. So I select this uh, power input to run all the drivers. And I set all, all the drivers like this. Okay? So, uh, which power I will attach here to the motor terminal, whatever is 12, 24, 48 or 56, this will drive these drivers. Now, if you don't put the, the jumper in HV, but you put it on VBB, even though, even if you put the, the power there, it will use the, this other power from the board. So, I was using 12 here, 12 volts for the board and 24 for the drivers. That's why I, uh, some people got confused uh, that uh, I would, uh, here you would select just 12 or 24, but that's only for my cases, okay? So if I use the a, a, a higher power, um, power source, uh, for example, 48 or 56, I will be using that for the, the drivers. Now, of course, you need to have drivers that support the higher voltages. In this case, I have the 5160 Pro, which support the higher power. Higher voltage, of course, but higher power. And that's it. So basically, I wanted to make sure that it was clear uh, for everyone. Uh, that video was for my custom 3D printer, uh, so 
other people have different uh, uh, requirements and this board allows you to have this flexibility. Uh, of course I'm talking about the BB Tech uh, uh, Manta M8P board. Okay, so hopefully uh, now I was clear. Uh, please leave a like on the on the video. Um, subscribe to the channel because I'm going to have more videos coming up. And uh, share the video. And if you have any question, please leave it in in the comments. Okay. Thank you very much. And bye bye.